story. This video has been in the archives for like a month or two. Uh, oh God. Let's talk about this hella nostalgic school lunch cafeteria food mystery lunch box. All the classics you can think of is in this box. If I remember what everything tastes like that's in this box, I'm gonna know how it feels when a girl busts her nut. And just to make it better, in between every time I taste something or, or try one of the snacks, I'm gonna give y'all like a rare high school, middle school, just a random story that y'all probably will never hear other than in this video. I'm excited, bro. Hold on, how I bust this joke? This is like a new BBL getting ripped out the plastic. So in total, I spent $300 on cafeteria food. <laughs> my whole school career, I had free lunch, bro. I spent more on this than my whole life. We got chicken rings, school breakfast pizza, fiestata pizza, super donuts. Then we got the classic Bosco sticks, the smiley fries, and then the breakfast classic French toast sticks. So we're gonna start off with a heavy hitter I know ain't gonna miss. I'm gaining five pounds tonight. Fuck it. All right, so it don't look like I remember it, but you know what I'm saying? Hold on. It, it, it's warm. It motherfucker warm now. Oh my God. How you taste so good? Hold on, man. Hold on, I was gonna tell y'all some stories, but this shit too good. Mm. I see, I'm always have a big back. Hey, I'm about to throw another one in here, bro. Why are these so good? I'm telling y'all, they put perks in these, bro. Got to. Ain't no powdered sugar. I don't even know what's in it. I don't even know what's on it. It just say super donut, five grams of protein. All right, healthy, 27 carbs. Damn, okay. Fiber, healthy, okay. Calcium, healthy. Vitamin D, C, B, E, potassium, vitamin A, Niacin, thiamine, riboflavin. Oh, that's healthy. So right now, this donut in first place. Easily first place. I could eat all of these, and there's more in the box, bro. I'm never gonna be skinny. But you know what? It's okay. Cause skinny people can't enjoy this. They're too busy being anorexic. They go to the gym like seven times a day, take trends, steroids, K2, all that stuff, just to be skinny. No, be fat. Enjoy it. There's two people on this earth that are always happy. A crackhead and a fat person when they eat. Tell me when I'm wrong. So ranking the super donut out of 10, give it like a nine. All right, so next we got the classic breakfast pizza. Two heavy hitters right off the start, bro. Now, I didn't know that this broke down into four different pizzas. So if I look like a fat ass, it wasn't even on purpose. Ooh, it's, ooh, it smelled like my, oh my God, it smelled like the hallways in high school. Oh my God, why does it, what the fuck? Why is it so good? All right, so I'm not gonna eat all four. <laughs> I want to, but I'm gonna eat, I mean, I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat like two. I might be the only one, but I used to put hot sauce on everything in school. I still do it now. Oh my God, he's so black. I'm a nigga. So let's start with some of my high school crushes. I'm not gonna say their names, but I highly doubt they see this video. Um, in high school, I had maybe like five, like for real crushes. I think all five of them have kids now too, so that's kind of crazy. But the first one, she came from another school and I was trying to get first dibs, bro. She wasn't having it. This shit hit. And then there was another girl, I think either sophomore or junior year, same thing. Transferred from another school, tried to get first dibs. I was in there. Until she got ran down by the football team. I was out of there, oh God. And there was there was one girl that was always in my one of my classes, but she was like hella quiet, so I thought she just didn't like people. Never said nothing to her, but she was bad. I think she like peaked after high school too. That's another thing. People who peak after high school, like me, oh my God, so fucking cute. And then the last three, one of them parked beside me, I think senior year, we would always like make eye contact, but I ain't gonna lie, I was a little bitch, bro. It's what it is, I ain't gonna lie. The other, okay, so the other one, she was on the cheerleader team. And then the other one, I think I had a kid in high school. And I was like, nah, I'm cool. You bad though, like you cute, but I can't, nah. A father at 17, the fuck? But out of those five high school crushes, I smashed one. I know, 20%, it's better than 0%. Like Deion Waiters went one for 55 one day and that's still, you made a shot. That's my mentality. Ranking the classic, nostalgic, all-American breakfast pizza, I give it, honestly, like an 8.2. I, 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 don't, I don't know, it's not enough sauce like it used to be. Maybe it's because it's frozen, and I, you know, I, I unthawed and all that stuff, but it's, it's not as much sauce as I remember. I remember having like white sauce all around my lips and stuff. Okay, so this one is the Fiestata pizza. This is more of like the regular, 
type of pizza. Um, I don't remember this looking like this. Oh, whoa! Okay, I remember how it tastes though. Mmm. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Hold on. This might be a bad bitch right here. Cheese, the meat, and the sauce. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh! Hold on. Shut the fuck up. This might be better than the breakfast pizza. Oh God. Breakfast pizza is nostalgic. You know what I'm saying? But this, yeah, that, that's better. Not by much, not by much, not by much, not by much, no, not by much. He fucking that shit up. So while I eat this, I'm gonna talk about one of my worst school in general memories, right? So I remember I was in middle school and I, my teacher, I still remember her name to the day, but I'm not gonna say it. She was in like the Navy. My mom knows she remember her name, everything. Like we, we loved her. So one day, I don't even know, like I didn't even know middle school, we get detention. I didn't know I could, I didn't know that was possible. I was in detention by myself. I had never seen this. I was in like fifth grade. I thought that was only on TV shows. No, I was in the for real detention. So I'm in there cooling, bro. Trying to look hard, like, man, you got me in detention, man. Free me. Free me till it's backwards type shit, right? And so she was like, Vic, you know why you're here, right? I'm like, man, I don't know why you just hating on the kid. Like, I'm trying to be hella tough. Hella tough, right? She's like, no, you know why you're here, right? I'm like, man, bro, like, what are you? I'm not listening to none of that. Bro. I'm not, none of that, none of that. I don't want to hear none of that. Hold on, one more bite. She gave me that whole, I see better in you speech. And at the time, I just wanna play Call of Duty. That's it. You messing up my KD and my grind time. And I, I hope it wasn't during double XP. And she asked me, she was like, well, why didn't you do your homework? <laughs> Real nigga, stood on business. I said, cause I don't feel like it. On God, I said, I don't feel like it. I'm not doing it. You know what she did? Call my mom, bro. <laughs> she called my mom ASAP. They had each other's phone numbers. So she called my mom and said, he said he don't want to do his homework and he not doing his homework. My heart dropped in my balls. Cause that shit, I was like, whoa, whoa, you kind of wild boy. Hey, listen, you still on business, but was that business worth standing on? I don't think so. You know, my dude's come pick me up. She not saying nothing the whole ride. Playing a little, you know, R&B, little Keisha Cole, little Fantasia. So I'm like, oh, she had a great day at work. I'm about to go home, grind his call of duty. We pull in the garage. She got out the car first. I'm like, <gasps> I'm smooth. She ain't really called my mom, bro. She, I'm like, I'm, she, she was playing. Me not thinking though, I'm like, I'm smooth. I, I, I'm good. So I go in the bathroom, get butterball naked, take a shower. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Wash it. I step out the shower on God. Came around the corner like a for real super jump and start whooping my ass, bro. With, a, with one of them thin switches. I'm still wet from the shower. So you add in that wetness with the whoopings. I was in there. So overall, the Fiesta pizza came in at a higher score than the breakfast pizza at about an 8.6 out of 10. All right, so now we got a little two for one special. We got the smiley fries and the chicken ring. Now I did use Chick-fil-A sauce, so that may make it a lot better than what it really is, but I don't remember the sauce I had with these. I, I really don't. My weight loss journey and people who peaked in high school. Let's talk about it, bro. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Whoa, that bit was hot, but that bit was good. But it, it's not seasoned. Ain't no seasoning. Ain't no seasoning. There's no seasoning. But like, they're not bad. You just gotta throw in your own sauce. Chicken ring, it got some black sprinkles on it, so I see some pepper. You know what I'm saying? Okay, that's mid. That, oh my God, that, ugh. That tastes like every Tyson chicken nugget that's been sitting in your deep freezer for like a year. And I'm gonna be honest, I don't know how, but you could tell who was gonna peak in high school and be, you know, that, that was their peak. That's, that's, that's the best they're gonna get looks wise. Like just, really just looks. That's really, that's really what peak in high school meant. Cause back then they didn't want it. I was like, I, I was fat as fuck in high school. I ain't gonna lie, I, I was pretty fat. So now, <laughs> <laughs> I'm still fat, but I'm not as, you know what I'm saying? You know, I'm still big. I, I will say fat, I'm still big. If y'all ever seen my workout videos and even weight loss videos, you know I was humongous, like like two tons. Two, I was two rotund big ass goddamn donuts put together. You could always tell the girls, especially who was gonna peak in high school, cause every girl I know back then that woke up eating hot Cheetos and, and hot pickles and like hot boiled eggs and like hot sausages, they got a felony, two kids, and one baby daddy don't play about her. Now on the opposite end, them quiet girls, for some reason, they got picked on, 
the girls with glasses. Oh my God, the girls with glasses. Now, they're the baddest ones, bro. They're the baddest. And, and the girls that was like real, like not muscular, but like muscular for them back then, like they had back, you, know, you can see their muscles, like that stuff. Now look at them, models. Yeah, I picked on back then for being too muscular. They had a strong cheekbone. Now you wish you had some strong cheekbones. I'm just saying. These nuggets is mid. I'm pissed. So overall, the smiley faces made me a little happy, but not happy enough. It's like a happy ending, you know. It'll get you through the day. So I'm gonna give that like a 6.4 out of 10. Chicken rings, five out of 10. The epitome of mid. All right, so next we got the French toast sticks. I'm not gonna lie, these shits don't look French. They, they look toasted, but they, they don't look French at all. There's nothing on here. There's literally, no, they're like, they light skin. They light skin as fuck. Look, this is bread. Nope, I'm good. I'm good. Nope, zero out of 10. And last but not least, possibly the baddest bitch of them all, the precious Bosco stick. Oh my God. I'm about to, I'm about to. Girl, you know you fine. Girl, you know you fine. You can wear a French tip or a bob. <laughs> Let's see if it tastes how it looks. I yep. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. I knew it, but I, I, I knew it though. That's why I said it for last. So boys, any other food videos you want to see, just let me know. Just make sure y'all let me know what y'all favorite cafeteria food was in the comment section. Yes, I'm talking while I'm eating. Suck my dick. I'm gonna finish fucking these real quick. Y'all be easy though. Ooh, did you see that key?